What's up everyone? What's good? It's Erica again and I have the second edition of What's Good Wednesdays. So today I have two things to talk to you about. One is Plum Market. It's a new grocery store, new-ish. It's been open probably about three months and it's in Old Town. And it started in Michigan and it came here to Chicago. It's very much like Whole Foods, except they focus more on local. So the nice thing about Plum Market is that you can go in there and you can see all your favorite brands. So for example, I went to the um, the bakery department, of course, because it's one of my favorite, and they had glaze and infused donuts there, which is one of the one of the top donut places here in Chicago. Um, they have their donuts there in the bakery department, along with so many other Chicago area bakeries and um, stores like in the barbecue section they had lily q barbecue sauce on sale there um so that's the really nice thing about plum market um otherwise it is very much like whole foods i will say it's not a place that you probably want to shop every day i did see the chobani yogurt there for a dollar 89 or something ridiculous so not a place to go every day but they do have really cool items for um, special occasions or if you're looking for kind of an obscure ingredient for a recipe definitely check that out um, they also had a very extensive candy section they had a, a C's candy um, station and then they had like a whole area for local candies um, their salad bar was just I mean ridiculous they had it was huge I mean so definitely a place to visit if you haven't been there um i would highly recommend it especially if you've got like a dinner party or you know some special occasion where you want to bring something fancy go to plum market second thing is trader joe's peanut butter okay so i went to trader joe and i got peanut butter just because i was out and this is on it it blew me away i was i didn't know peanut butter was supposed to taste like this literally it says the ingredients are dry roasted peanuts and salt and that's it and there's no turning back jeff uh, peter pan nothing it has nothing on this trader joe peanut butter tastes like what peanut butter is supposed to taste like my peanut butter consumption has significantly gone up just because of this peanut butter as you can see, almost gone. I, I put it on apples, like it's it's so good. Um, so highly recommend Trader Joe peanut butter um, and then Plum Market. And I'll just say there's probably gonna be a lot of Trader Joe items on What's Good Wednesdays. That's what I have for you today. Looking forward to seeing you next week. And that's what's good.